first of all you will draw a line so look here I am drawing a line like this draw another line here wide this is the true line I have drawn here now what you have to do three places you have to erase with your eraser erase here the two line erase here the two line and erase here the two line and what will you do you first this the last line you join it like this here you have erased already you do like this okay now you have also erase here so you will do a, a little bit line a little bit below to make an arc two arcs then from this line you you mate it from this line you join it from this line you join it from this line you join it you are seeing that you have already erased here you draw an oval separate structure here you draw an oval here and from this line you join this line to this line like this okay so you draw a shape like this this is looking marvelous from here start from here okay so now you draw like this and this line is like this okay now this from here this is the two point you join it this is, this is the centromeric point this is the centromeric point now here the two chromatids passes through this secondary constriction this is the primary constriction this is the secondary constriction and for again it will become wider and again you draw like this so this is the structure you have already drawn make it more beautiful i am drawing with this black sketch to so look first of all i am drawing this like this Okay. the two chromatids uh, already I am just drawing with red color to make it more distinct here the two chromatids actually attached here This is called point of centromere. Okay, already this is drawn. Very beautiful. This is looking very beautiful now. This is called primary constriction. And this is called secondary constriction. Secondary constriction is the site of nucleolar formation. So this region is also called. This region is also called nuclear organizing region region this question also comes to level it so i have explained you last part this is called telomere these two threads is called chromatids and you are looking two chromatids over here and this is the primary constriction where the two chromosomes actually attached at a point and this point of attachment is called centromere and this is actually nucleolus present sometimes satellite the figure of eukaryotic chromosomes okay and in this way very easily you can draw this and once again i am just repeating you now what the structures are this is the satellite portion and the nucleolus here the oval separate and the two thread which is passing through this pellicle envelope 
is called chromatids here the two chromatids are attached at the and the pellicle is invented at the two places this is called primary constriction and this is called secondary constriction and in primary constriction the two chromatids are attached together this is called centromere the point of attachment of two, two chromatids is called centromere this is also called kinetic core and you are looking that there is no uh, attachment over here in the chromosomes and in secondary construction there is a also uh, for the site of formation of nucleolus so this is also called nuclear organizing region and these are the telomere this is the last part in this way uh, you can draw and label any parts which, which is asked in board exam so okay guys